Meantime, the trial of the Strongsville teen charged with murder in a deadly crash continued today. We were there for day three of the proceedings. Mackenzie Shirilla, at the time 17 years old, is accused of intentionally crashing a vehicle with her 20-year-old boyfriend, Dominic Russo, and his 19-year-old friend, Davion Flanagan, both inside that car. Her two young passengers died when she crashed into a building in northwest Strongsville. This was back in July of last year. Today, the prosecution called one of the Metro Health trauma surgeons that worked on Shirilla's medical report to the stand. They asked her to read part of that report of Shirilla admitting fault in the crash. But the defense emphasizes that Shirilla did not crash that car intentionally. Patient stated she, open quote, wanted to die, close quote, and that it was her fault for killing her boyfriend. You just said and read that Mackenzie said it was her fault, correct? I did read those words. That's what it says. It didn't say that she purposely killed someone, did it? Those words do not appear in that note. Okay. And whatever those words were, you weren't there to hear them. That is correct. The trauma surgeon also cited that Shirilla told their team that she did not remember what led to the crash. We'll have more from that trial coming up for you at 6 o'clock.